of Panjim and we are with Eric Johnson today. So Eric, as we go on our walk around, if you don't mind, we'll keep this camera open and see what it captures. Mm -hmm. So, a lot of small guest houses here and uh, it's supposed to be low rise. It's, I hope it remains this Does way. Does have a name? It's called, uh, it's called, uh, this, this is actually, uh, that part is San Tome. And this is Fontanus. Fontanus because there's a fountain at one end of the place. Mm -hmm. It's also called Mala in the local language, which also means fountain. And so it's the fountain quarter. It's act yeah, the Fontanus really yeah. I I don't think it gets translated into English, but that's what it would be. There there is there is a place this side here called the Fundasam Orient. So it's actually a Portuguese cultural foundation. I don't know if it's open today. We'll, we'll just go and have a look. Lots of tourists and people complain about too many tourists in this area. So, <clears throat> so this uh, Fundasang Orient is actually a, a cultural foundation from Macau. Set up with revenues from there. Actually, the Portuguese had some gambling tax on which they set up the foundation. So it's a cultural foundation now. When it came in the 90s, it was very unacceptable to to run culture based on based on gambling revenues but today we have our own casinos here and also it's not looked upon so badly so they have a lovely art exhibition going on there permanently and uh, maybe maybe being saturday it might not be open but we'll check this is a 300 year old building and it's called panjimin so 350 years old or something run by some friends of ours so a lot of uh, you know travelers and all this is their preferred staying place Hotel. yeah 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 some art centers and it's a very artsy kind of place but now undergoing all this smart city kind of renovation so it's in a big mess here's one art gallery just we'll just pop in and pop out yeah yeah i know i know hi can we just have a look Are you looking for something specific? No, no, no. <laughs> like your friends? No, just, I mean, like, you know, always just keeping in touch and uh, getting to know what's going on. So these are run by some friends of friends and things like that, you know. So the same place which owns Panjimin runs this center. They have a lot of events here, books and art exhibitions and things like that. Wow, this is beautiful. Interesting. The old chair, no? The colonial. It has a strange name. They call it the Bombay Fornicator. If you please. Whatever that suggests. Tribal art. Oh, wow. Watercolors. Of the place, I guess. Yeah. Interesting. Ah, so okay. They are telling you. Some of the nearby buildings. Yeah. This is Panjimin that's connected to this place. Ah, so okay. These are all the. This is the, a little. Um, this is the yeah, complex. In, introduction to the place and then all the group, uh, you know, which is part of the same group like Gitanjali Gallery, gallery is this, mm -hmm. and Panjimin is the one across, and Panjim Posada is just there. So they run two hotels, two boutique mm -hmm. hotels, and one art gallery. Mm -hmm. That's what they say. So people are really complaining about the number of tourists here. Goans have been complaining about that for a long, long time because they have mixed feelings about tourism. Sure. But uh, well, because some people win and some people lose. Yeah, 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 yeah. And also we have quite an intense amount of tourism coming in here, you know. So people feel a bit swamped. So, this are employment. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It is. It is. Invaders. Yeah, yeah. But you know, it also depends on. Uh, I guess on the space and the carrying capacity and all those kind of things. So, but you find some very unique kind of innovations here. A lot of these paintings have been 
sponsored by this uh, cultural center. Oops, where are we? Okay, here we are, here. Some old schools and things like that, no? Look very much like colonial Singapore, no? The parts of the... Mm -hmm. when, I, when I visited Singapore, I thought, oh God, this is very much like... Why did you visit Singapore? Oh my God, it was ages back, some conference or the other, you know how it is. Interesting place. Something Foss-ish? Yeah, 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 very much, if I remember rightly. Foss or Foss-ish. So these people have a cultural, sorry, a musical performance once a year called the Festival on the Mont. So there's a chapel on the hill there where they have this festival. I wonder what's this Mont festival? Okay, they've announced it there. Bhai sahab, khula hai? Good exhibition? Evening. Good evening. Kaisa hai? Sab theek hai. Exhibition? Khula hai? Kitan exhibition? Exhibition hoke hai, close hua. Nahi, nahi, wo, wo. Andar ka? Koi bhi sab band hai. Sab band hai? Hmm. Trindad bhi band hai? Ek ki minute andar ja sakta hai? Nahi? Allowed nahi hai, abhi abhi laga. Allowed nahi hai. Yeah. It's on today. So, exactly today at 6 o'clock. That's the classic one. Hmm. This is this uh, This is Goan Goan music? Yeah, Goan music. And this is classical. Yeah, so this is at six o'clock. Okay. This is one of your relatives? No, 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 no. We just uh, <laughs> yeah. So this is at uh Baisa ticket chayena unko pass chayena. Pass katam hua. Pass katam hua unko. Ha? Koi nahi. Koi nahi hai pass bhi nahi hai. Ha. Yeah, yeah. So there's a bad rush to get passes for these events because they are hugely popular, you know. So all these music related things. It would have been nice if we could go inside, but he says it's all off. So they have they, they have this uh, art exhibition by... Thank you, uh, thank you, Basa. They have this art exhibition by a guy called Trindad, uh, Antonio Trindad. And he is supposed to be the Rembrandt of the East. His portraits are really amazing, like, you know, he's... Uh, Worked about 100 years back and things like that. So then they've tried to restore with their money, they've tried to restore some of these buildings and things like that. That's one of those portraits. Yeah, yeah, that is one of his portraits actually. You're right. So he's got this series of. Uh, it's supposed to be open now. Yeah, but you know what? <clears throat> Monday to Saturday, 10 to 6. Yeah, they, they took the exhibition to Delhi. They, they sent it to Delhi. So it's all, it's all been... It, no, it came back, but it's not in state. It's, it's not properly set up or something like that. See how dusty it is here. So you have a lot of these kitschy hotels here, restaurants and things like that, no? Where, which are like, you know, very much... I think this is called, what, Bombay? Bombay coffee, Bombay coffee roasters. roasters. Bombay coffee roasters. Just imagine. So, and then you have this well. This is a famous central point of uh, of Pontanus, where you have this well. It's not your wishing well, but comes close. No, where's the well? Oh, I think it's somewhere here. Or no, this is the the well is somewhere here. What's this? By Fundusa Orient. It's a cow. 1999. And then the lanes are there and there are bakeries and traditional shops. You have, you have this place which, uh, which actually is trying to popularize records, musical records. And uh, they sell turntables and they, you know, kind of sell these records which have become fashionable again. Trying to be retro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Quite successfully so, but costly. What's going to be analog? You know, this is amazing. They have this. They have this space for seniors, for senior citizens. Careful, kid. So, some philanthropist, no, has uh, donated his money to end place to set up this place for senior citizens because considering how lonely they are and... But you're not senior yet? I'm going to be. When? In a few months. December. December. 60. 
60 is the is the, is the, the in, point in india yeah in india people people are surprised normally they say it's 65 and is that when you start getting a state pension no 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 it, it all depends you know if you work for the state you get a state pension but we didn't so it, it yeah we didn't you and somebody most of us many of us like you know so all of us all of us people <laughs> yeah but no regrets for that i don't have any regrets for that I, spent my life very productively. This is a former school turned into a children's library. Amazing. Also run by Sujata Norona. No relation of mine. I must tell you that before you ask. So I figure you're a mafia. All by yourself. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I mean, I don't know. There's a higher... Okay, so they are having a banyan tree exhibition. And uh, then they... What is this? Borrow. Baro, bookworm store. So, they have this space where, where, where. You don't have any kids you want to buy a book for? No, no, I, I, they are out of the age. But when we, when we had, we used to come here very often and it was extremely helpful. So no it's more a library. Yet. No, 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 not so soon. It's a, it's a, it's, it's a library. It's more than it's a bookshop. It's a bookstore, is it? Huh, bookworm, yeah, yeah. Maybe the books also is to deaccession books. No, libraries I, always have too many books. No, they they sell some new books also because they stock it from us. I know, so so you know. But uh, the main activity is of a library, and they have a cultural center. This used to be a school first, and its name is it, it used to be called Mustifan School, meaning Musti, meaning uh, a fist, and it was a fund raised by a fistful of rice donations from people in the neighborhood. So it's quite historic in that sense. It's got this old world charm to it. Okay. Maybe we'll walk till the end a little bit further and see. Looks like we can go up. You can go up. You can go up. There's a yeah. temple. No, not here. Uh, no. Aren't those stairs? There are stairs, but... Uh, we'll but take them. We, we'll take those. I'll show you. There's a bit of more picturesque stairs there near the temple that's your preferred stairs uh, yeah actually oh god if we can if we can get through this uh, steeple chase here but uh, the place on the hill is called altino this was the old initial residential locality of panjim and altino is up there on the hill so eventually any stairs you take any road you take up you'll reach more or less there clinic Neha. Why does this place, this town we're in, have two names? You know, it's a legacy of the past, so they kept changing. Not two, it's got five names, if you ask me. Each in a different language and each in the preferred, you know. Uh, so the reason why the name, there are different names is because of the different languages. Yeah, and also the old, old way of naming and the new way of naming. So Panjim, P-A-N-J-I-M would be in English, what most of us use when we talk about it. And then, sorry for bumping into you. And then the official name as of now is P-A-N-A-J-I. Oh God, so this why, is... So why, why, I mean, one of those existed first and then the other one came along. Yeah, why? so it's like a new elite, no? So a new, a new set of rulers. Oh my God. Wood, he thinks you're in, in inspecting them. So a new set of rulers would bring in their favorite name. So like Panaji was your favorite name after 61, but to my mind it was a misspelling of the Portuguese P-A-N-G-I-M, okay, which was spelled as P-A-N-G-I-M but pronounced as Panji, Panji, because the, the, most heads. yeah, most heads, but we, we are going ahead, but the, so the, these variations are, they are political and they are, they are linguistic also, respelling. Yeah, yeah, they are basically spellings, but respellings with a little bit of like, you know, I get in my way kind of thing. So, Panji was the Portuguese sp spelling, and then you had Nova Goa, which was another Portuguese name in New Goa. And of course, oh gosh, this is huge, yeah. They, they have a huge draining pro drainage problem here in the monsoon, so they are probably trying to... And 
then you beside Nova Goa, the funniest is that the actual name, what is on everyone's lips in the local language, is Ponje, Ponje, P O N J J E, which is very different from the English, from the uh, Marathi versions of it. Here it has the 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 official name, Panaji, Mala Panaji. So there is a little, a little or a lot competition for space and definition of this is supposed to be a local bakery you just said marathi right um, yeah marathi why, why didn't you say kankoni you know i'll come to that patra kide ha any snacks patties patties you will eat something sure patties eat. what veg meat what veg egg veg and egg egg veg di veg egg egg mountain dew egg 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 di Dundi. And you have some uh, cone ice cream or something? Take your pick, he says. Yeah. Chocolate? I would have that chocolate one. Yeah. Or the butterscotch, I guess. Yeah. I had the chocolate the other day over in Old Goa. Okay. Chocolate is my favorite for some reason. Hey, Baba, paper plan, gal, paper plan, gal, bag, and naka. How about it? Let's give it in a serviette. My keys are going to fall out any time. Thank you. Thanks. Only me? What about you? No, no, it's coming. It's oh. coming. Should the I grab one first. of these for, for me? Yeah, one, yeah, one, please, one please, for please, you? please, please. Tada. Much egg chocolate, dita cone, maka. One chocolate cone. He'll give, he'll give. Oh, oh awesome. cone. Thank Fair you. Enough. No, black currant. Okay, we'll do, we'll do. You got them. I've got, I've got it in my pocket. Uh oh, I don't know. I know it is. So what does it say about us that I started with the cold and you're starting? With the cold? <laughs> yeah, it does say something. What it tells you is that in India, in Goa, wherever, if you're into warm food, you're safe. Of course, the cold is also okay, I guess. Bo water has to be boiled, no? Depends. You're used to it. But Singapore is not, is not India, of course. I'm, Sing I'm Singapore, immune. not even Asia. It's true, but I'm immune to everything. <laughs> I drink the water everywhere. Really? Uh -huh. Another road up. But not, not this. Not yet your favorite. Not yet. Beer. There was a time where I, I used to test my stomach by drinking uh, ra railway station water in Bombay. Not anymore. I don't well, now know. Now you're almost <laughs> no, I, I don't know if I maybe I could do it. Maybe it's all in the mind, I don't know. Well there's there's a degree to which it's the self. Fulfilling hmm. prophecy, right? That's true. That's true. Very true. The more exposure you get, yeah. the more resistance you are. Yeah. Rajan Taylor. Yeah, I do want to say thank you for, what for? nudging what for? What me for? To, to, to try hard enough to get a car because it's a lot of fun to drive. I see. Some people love it, no? I love my two wheels, not my four. Not four. I would be happy with two, but I have two friends with me. Okay, so. okay, okay, okay. So what was the process to get an international license, really? It's not 
actually an international license. It's an international permit. Okay. And you get it from your national automobile association. I see. Whatever it may be. I see. So in your case it was? Well I knew that I could get one from the US because I'm an American. I have yeah. an American driver's license. And that's what I've always done in the past. Hmm. And, but I've always been annoyed by that because yeah. it's hard work, right? I have to get in touch with somebody in the U.S. Hmm. I have to send them documents and then they have yeah. to send it back. And I have to figure out how to pay for it. But once you prompted me, yeah. I thought, well, why don't... I mean, I have a Singapore license. Yeah. So then I went looking for the Singaporean I see. Automobile Association. And I called them up. Yeah. And they said, sure. What did it involve? So I walked over to the Singapore Automobile Association. Yeah. And I showed them my Singaporean driver's license. Yeah. And my Singaporean identity card. Yeah. And I paid them twenty dollars, and they gave me international. Wow. Program. This is the fountain. Ah. Stagnant. But otherwise flowing. Yeah, it is flowing. So this is the fountain after which the quarter yeah. is named. Yeah. Yeah. Fountain House. Yeah. Very close to that temple. Related? Yeah, I would guess. I would guess. Because all religious places had some water source and you know. The very scenic houses, no? In the concrete yard, all these houses normally form the backdrop. So they paint them on huge canvases. You could have seen the guys standing out and staring at the world going by from their windows. Amazing. Branch moving over there. Are they, oh, they're trimming the tree. How about that? Coconut? No, coconut oh, will wave in the wind, no? They're actually cutting, they're down cutting. pieces of the tree. So okay. They're taking that branch down. There's okay. A guy up there at the okay. top with the okay. rope. Okay. 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 Letting that branch oh, yes, down. yes, 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 yes. You didn't want to just cut it and have it fall because it might fall on something. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, I can imagine all of these houses will eventually become boutique hotels. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I wonder if the record place is somewhere here. One of my friends used to work in this uh, pizza place and he had this reputation of making the best pizzas in Goa. I don't think he's there anymore. But uh, where is the record shop? Oh, I see a circle down there. Hmm, I think so. That must be it. Yes. It's either a record shop or a donut shop. <laughs> or a bagel shop. But it says record. So okay, okay, okay. It says uh, something in the record. Okay. For the record, it's called. Yeah, yeah, correct. Right, right, right. right. Oh, but I have a... I have a road rules yeah. question for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For the most part, right. driving is the same everywhere in the world. Yeah. Oh no, it's an international language. It's a different language in different countries. It's terrible in Goa, don't ask me. I think it's pretty much the same. But, there's one rule. Hmm. There's two rules. I have, I have questions about both of these. There's two rules, yeah. which can actually be very different yeah. in different places. One of the rules is, when you are driving into a traffic circle, Yeah. Who has the right of way? The right, no? Person coming from the right? It depends on the country. Yeah. Sometimes it's whoever's in the circle, and sometimes it's who's entering the circle. Really? So which is it? Here. I, I, I don't know. We were told, I'm not so great at rules, road rules. We were told that the person coming on the right has the right of way. So that means the person in the circle, the car in the circle, has the right of way. I'm, the, I'm doing the entering. Yeah. The car in the circle always has the right of way. Yeah, I guess so. so. I have to yield. Hmm. But it, it's not true in France. Really? In France, the car entering the circle has the right of way. Really? So, I mean, it's a fairly fundamental difference. Okay. It's okay. not just like, you know, be careful not to hit the cow. Or yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> So that's funny that you're not sure. No, I'm not much of a four-wheel driver myself, so. It has nothing to do with wheels. Yeah, it has even to do two with wheels. driving. Two wheels and four wheels are the same for if, this. If you're on two wheels, you don't bother too much with the rules. You know how it is, so.
Well, I think here almost nobody bothers with rules at all, but I'm still off, interested. Goa is terrible. Goa is terrible. Even crowded cities like Belgaum and all, you have better drivers. I would say India is all anarchic. Oh, so where's the record place? Yes, it is right here. The record place, ma'am. Records. The record place is uh, the record place here. Here, it's open. I don't know. Okay. But uh, here. Okay. That side, that part is. Uh, okay. 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 Thanks. Maybe. Maybe we we'll just try here. Oh yes. What is? Yes. Except it's leaking. Yeah. There is a. Uh, uh, Gallery and there okay. is my exhibition. Okay. I, I okay. invite you. Okay, from okay, okay, so okay. You are from which country? From Ukraine. UK. Ukraine. From Ukraine. Let's go and see. Come. No. You know Russian? Mm -hmm. Russian. 